Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to add textures and skins into Minecraft Pocket Edition. As, and right now I'm opening Pocket Edition, as you can see, I have no texture pack, and I'm about to prove that by opening my world. And there's no textures, no skins. Nothing. It is vanilla Minecraft, same texture as normal. Everything is normal. But, to add the texture, it's really simple, and the apps you're going to need our zip signer and explore file browser and I would also recommend ES with that to install the app and now you are going to have to uninstall Minecraft in this tutorial but you won't lose any of your wor worlds so first you have to have a texture pack that you're going to be using along with an APK Minecraft pocket this will also be in the description below so now you have to open this and make sure both of them are open to your SD card and to whatever folder is in s ha you have your um, APK and um, texture pack or skin inside. Now to do this for skins it's a bit different and if you want to, I'll have my own tutorial completely on that. It will be the same process as this but a bit different and I'll, if you want the link to that, I'll leave the link to that video in the description. So you want to have both of these open. And Faithful is the texture pack I'll be using. So you want to hold on your APK. Click Open APK as Zip on the bottom. And don't click on Assets. Just keep it clicked onto the APK. And then you want to go to... Um... Oh, right, now I'm clicking assets makes it click and then open up your um dot zip file with your texture pack and click on your assets and copy and make sure it's copying and check this it can, uh, mine you can't have a copying to assets like me um you have to have it be copying to the pocket edition dot apk and as you can see I'm now doing that so now I'm copying it to the apk and you want to have it overwrite and do this for all. And this might take a bit of time. And now it's at 70% and should be about done. And now that was the hardest part. The next parts are going to be easy. And so now all you're going to have to do is leave the file browser. And if you want to edit, add a skin too, stop at this part and watch my next video. So now you're going to go to your apps, drawer, and you're going to have to uninstall Minecraft. You won't lose any of your worlds if you did this before. You already know this. It won't do anything bad. It'll, you'll keep all your worlds, you'll keep everything. Because all the worlds are saved onto the SD card, on, not on the system storage, which is mine, where Minecraft is saved onto. So now, you're going to want to have to find the app called Zip Signer. And um, Zip Signer, it's on the Google Play Store for free. You can download it. So. And that's what it looks like. Make sure you get the right one. I'll leave a link to it in the description along with um, the file browser I'm using. And once you open it, you want to f find the in, choose in slash out. And then you want to find the APK that you just edited. I put mine in my YouTube folder. And then it's the Minecraft Pocket Edition v0.10.3.apk point point apk and you don't have to do what I'm doing but I recommend it so you could find your thing easily and I'm just renaming it it's still going to start slash emulate slash zero slash youtube slash texture packs but I'm changing the name of the apk 
uh, you shouldn't do this because you might mess up, but I made a faithful uh, APK. If you don't know how to do this, don't do it. If you know how, you could easily do it. And now it's faithful.apk, and now I signed the file. And, um, it should be done soon. And once it's done, you could simply install the app, and you, it'll, you'll be done with the APK. But, this is just for textures, and I'll leave a link to... Minecraft forum and pocket edition forums you can find texture packs too if you want that they have some good texture packs but I recommend looking at YouTube texture pack reviews to make sure that they're safe I might start doing some because there's a lot of viruses for them and I'm going to go to this and you could use um, any file browser you want to install it, but you had to use Explorer to move the text pack. And now I'll say uninstalling Minecraft. And you have to uninstall it for this to work. If you don't uninstall it, you'll be getting an error right now. And it'll say package with the same um, config, I think. It's already installed and won't let you install it. So that's why uninstalling it is very crucial. And I'll show you that I still have all my worlds once it's done. And it's almost done. And now I'm just going to click done. You could click open, but I didn't because I just wanted to go back and open it through here. Because it's not only faster than clicking open. I don't know if it is for you guys, but for me it is. And now Minecraft is opening, and it takes a bit of time to load for the first time with your new texture pack, but that shouldn't really matter. And. I'm recording still, I was just going to check. And here I have my world YouTube creative. And once I click it, I'll open it. And as you can see, the loading screen already looks different because that's what the dirt looks like. And Faithful, I like it because it doesn't change that much, but it just changes a bit and makes it look a bit real, more realistic, which is good. Some of the better blocks are cobblestone and dirt. And I was going to see if the villagers are different, but they aren't in this version. And here's the, what everything looks like. And stone, um, here's what that looks like. It looks a bit different, but it mainly looks in the inventory bar different, not when you're holding a couple items like the clock. And that's water because I want to show you how water looks different I'm pretty sure lava also works different but I didn't test it and here are some other blocks basically everything is a bit different and that's what oak planks look like and if you enjoyed thanks for thanks for watching and if you enjoyed like comment and subscribe comments helped me a lot because you won't be getting this video if it wasn't for a comment that